mushrooms are not limited to just the standard varieties. Some consumable mushrooms are distinctive, and that is reflected in their price. Some of these mushrooms are quite commonly known, while some varieties are quite rare. The price of the world's most expensive mushrooms typically reflects their scarcity and the methods used to produce them. Here, we will take a look at 12 of the world's most expensive mushrooms. It is worth noting that this list contains some truffles as well, since they are very close to mushrooms, with the only difference being where they grow and their size. Whether you are simply curious about the topic or are researching growing mushrooms for profit, let's explore the world's most pricey fungi. Yatsa gunbu The Yatsa gunbu mushrooms have an interesting appeal, though it isn't their taste. Ancient Tibetan texts claim that this particular fungus is an aphrodisiac, a belief many still hold today. Due to its reputation, it's very expensive, costing the rough equivalent of $2,000 per ounce. It is no wonder that consuming even a small amount of this mushroom is still reflective of one's status. These mushrooms grow under the soil in knobby carrot shapes, long and skinny. When they are consumed or otherwise intaken by ghost moth caterpillars, they act as a parasite, effectively consuming their host from the inside. As the caterpillars slowly perish, they do so standing upright in the dirt. The fungus pokes through the caterpillars' heads, reaching through the surface every spring. The mushrooms can be harvested in the high altitudes of the Himalayas at about 3,000 to 5,000 meters, 9,000 to 16,000 feet. European White Truffle Truffles are commonplace around Europe, typically found growing underground at the base of oak trees. To find them, people use trained truffle dogs and female pigs who can sniff them out by detecting the mushroom's strong odor. Depending on the harvest, as well as the market, these can cost anywhere from $1,500 to $4,000 per pound. Truffles are highly prized in Europe, mainly because they are some of the rarest of Earth's products. White truffles are nearly impossible to cultivate, which leaves harvesters at the mercy of their collection, which directly influences the high prices. However, other European countries have had somewhat more luck harvesting them recently, which has brought the prices moderately down. Black truffles are also being cultivated in more places, allowing them to be available to markets for mushroom lovers and chefs around the world. So what is the most expensive white truffle? That title still belongs to the Italian white alba, also known as the tuba magnatum pico. It is still the most expensive of the well-known mushrooms. Matsutake mushrooms The short-stemmed Japanese matsutake sports a well-formed cap with distinctive gills underneath it and is an easily recognizable pale, small stain of mushrooms that is appreciated for its aroma and its mildly fruity and spice flavor. The Japanese Matsutake mushroom grows under red pines in Japan's Tamba region, located near Kyoto. Traditionally linked with autumn, this mushroom strain is considered a delicacy in Japan, but due to the reduction of Japanese red pine forests due to havoc and devastation wreaked by insects, the habitat where these mushrooms grow is constantly shrinking. To make matters worse, cultivating these mushrooms has proven overwhelmingly challenging. With everything working against it, Matsutake mushrooms are hard to come by, and the rarity drives up their extremely high prices. They can be purchased at prices of $1,000 to $2,000 per pound. Black Truffles Black truffles are tough to harvest, yet they are quite adored in Europe. This leads to some areas selling these in a black market of sorts. Female pigs were commonly used to root these truffles out, though trained dogs have taken their place. The reason? The pigs didn't just want to find the black truffles, they were quite fond of feeding on them. The tuba melanosporum, or the French black perigord, is still harvested largely using the methods involving trained animals. But due to the market being rife with demand and long shipping delays being a constant point of struggle, these primarily European products have moved largely to the United States and Australia. In particular, producers in Oregon, California, Tennessee and Kentucky have had the most success. But that doesn't mean that the truffles are cheap. In 2017, the United States saw the import of 425 tons of truffles in fresh, canned and dried forms. According to statistics collected by the USDA, that marked a stunning 75% increase from just seven years prior. These are primarily sold to restaurants and high-end chefs. 
They are also harvested traditionally in the United States, on a seasonal basis much like they are in Europe. Across the pond, Croatia and Slovenia are two of the new hottest markets where truffles, as well as truffle products, are growing more popular. They can be purchased at wholesale prices of $800 to $900. Morels If you ever see what looks like a row of trolls lining the forest floor, you have probably come across the conically headed, ruffled and sturdy stemmed morels. These amusing-looking fungi retain their comical look even while being served with other foods or cooked. If you wanted to purchase a pound of dried morels, you'd be expected to shell out $254 per pound, while fresh morels go for $30 to $90 per pound. The reason dried morels are more expensive is generally that they are lighter. The cone-shaped ruffled head, which is spongy to the touch, can only be found during the spring months in the wild. Their flavor is similar to shiitake mushrooms' nuttiness, but their taste is more unique and intense. When served, these are rarely included in meals, but rather as garnish, sometimes alongside compatibly flavored sauces, mostly due to their small size. Finding fresh morels is hard, while cultivating them is even harder. Their distinctive appearance makes them hard to mistake, but most people still prefer to purchase dried morels for domestic cooking uses. Chanterelles When spotting the golden chanterelle on a forest floor, one could mistake it for a moss-surrounded flower. Known for cluster growing on humid days after heavy rainfalls, these particular mushrooms are purchased dry for about $225 per pound. If one has seen the chanterelles before, they are quite simple to identify. They have ridges that run down the sides of the stem and have smooth caps atop. Generally, they are located in central Ukraine and central Europe, specifically where pines and beech trees grow in the same community. Their flavor has a hint of spice, and their aroma is light and fruity. While they can range from orange and yellow to white in color, it is the golden variety that is most commonly sought out. They tend to surface in late spring, but because they rely on high humidity, sauna-like atmosphere to thrive, they are generally gone by early autumn, limiting their harvesting window. Inoki mushrooms these fungi fruit clumps are some of the most interesting edible mushrooms out there. They can be purchased for about $108 per pound, or for $288.75 for mail-order packages of 25 pounds. Their mild flavor reminds many of radish or white grapes. In appearance, they resemble a mini cauliflower or white button-ended glossy bean sprouts. Packed with folate, niacin, potassium, thiamine, phosphorus, riboflavin, and pantothenic acid, these little mushrooms are super packed with nutritional content. The inoki is included in many soup and stir-fry dishes, with the attached ends cut and separated into individual strands. Even when cooked, the inoki, commonly found in most Asian dishes, will continue to produce a crunching sensation when chewed. Porcini mushrooms there are several different species of the porcini mushrooms, of which the Boletus edulis, the king bolet, is among the most prominent. They are hard to cultivate and are usually found in hardwood forests in hemlock-covered groves, beneath pine trees and spruce chestnut trees. These piglets, as their Italian name reflects, are sold in sliced and dried form for $55 to $70 per pound. The cost is that much because they are not easy to locate, since they do not grow in many locations. Porcini have 10-inch long, sturdy, bulky stamps, along with oversized caps, both of which make them look heavy. To pair with that, when they are mature, their actual weight reflects their look, as they can weigh as much as several pounds. Their flavor is nutty and hearty, with a distinction that makes them unique by common inclusions in many dishes, primarily Italian ones. Their utilization in meals is, however, certainly not limited to Italy, as they also grow and are harvested across other European nations and across many parts of North America. Lion's Mane Distinguished by the shape of a round balloon with shaggy long spines or hair, the lion's mane doesn't necessarily have a universally defined metric. Its shape resembles the head of a male lion, or more precisely, a pompon. Some refer to its shaggy appearance as a bearded tooth mushroom. Depending on the mushroom's variety, they can be purchased for anywhere between $8 and $36 per pound. The lion's mane, Herichium erinacusum, is among the most otherworldly edible fungus. It is most commonly found on logs from either dead or dying trees in the fall across Europe, 
Asia and North America. Younger lion's mane mushrooms are white, but as they age, they take on a more yellow or tan hue. In terms of texture and taste, it is commonly compared to the mild flavor of crab or lobster. Before people realized that this mushroom strain was edible, it was already hailed for its medicinal qualities. It has a high antioxidant content and is being actively studied for a somewhat amazing ability to regenerate nerve tissue. Shiitake Mushrooms For ages, the specialty variety mushrooms have been a staple in Asian meals, but more recently their popularity has increased and they are not commonly consumed in Western meals too. They are relatively small, growing only 2 to 4 inches in size, with 2 to 4 inch caps. Each of the several shiitake varieties has a somewhat different taste and texture, used in both dried and fresh form in various East Asian cuisines, primarily across China and Japan. Their pleasant taste and meaty texture pair well with other ingredients. It is also regarded as a medicinal mushroom for its anti-inflammatory, anti-carcinogenic and antimicrobial properties. Depending on the marketplace, the shiitake mushrooms typically cost between $12 and $24 per pound. Oyster Mushrooms Sometimes known as the abalone mushroom, the large pearl white or pale grey oyster mushrooms are short with fluted gills on the underside. These mushrooms have a strange nearly alien resemblance and sometimes show up as pink, gold, elm and blue. Per pound, these can be found priced between $5 and $15. Innovative chefs have been increasingly using oyster mushrooms in new recipes across the United States, with the mushroom commonly being purchased at various farmers' markets. While the best time to use them in meal preparations is while they are fresh immediately after harvesting, they do have a shelf life of several days. They can also be dried easily. The best part is that they are simple to cultivate, making them a mushroom that is easy for novices to handle. Interested parties can even purchase home sprouting kits through mail orders or in marketplaces in most large cities. Their appearance is alien and delicate appearance with a peculiar flavor and meaty texture. Though they are common in the cuisine of East Asian nations like China, Korea and Japan, they are actually native to the United States, Northern Europe and Siberian regions of Asia. Kalahari Truffles Known to locals as African potatoes, the Kalahari Desert of Namibia grows Kalahari truffles. They are cheaper than their higher-priced counterparts, sold for roughly $4 per pound from earlier in this list, but they do have a certain mystique about them. Unlike both black and white truffles, this variety has a milder taste and scent. They're also easily foraged, as they stand out and flourish in the sandy landscape, peering through the cracks. Therefore, they do not need pigs or dogs to sniff them out, just a set of human eyes around camel thorn trees. While they are most commonly consumed in raw form along with spices in certain side dishes, some chefs utilize them in creative ways in their meal preparation. They can commonly be found in roadside stands, open markets and restaurant menus. They are even converted into truffle butter, which has a very distinctive flavor. In fact, one restaurant in Namibia's capital city actually serves Kalahari truffle ice cream as one of their more popular desserts. Bringing you more value per minute than any other entrepreneurial channel out there, or at least trying to. We would appreciate if you at least subscribe, like, and share this video. That would mean the world to us.